at that beauty. Yeah. We've been wanting to try the new generation of fish gum and see how it works. We're trying that today. Watch this. Got a charger this morning. Did not know the wind was gonna be this bad. It's good to learn surf fishing in bad conditions. It's gonna make it so much easier when the conditions are good. So today it's gonna be difficult to see when the fish are biting. It's gonna be hard to keep your line in the right spot because the current's gonna be stronger because of the winds. Let's see what we can catch. When the waves are turning this much, typically the water's gonna be dirtier. I am using our fishing girl green float rig here. We're gonna put some of this uh, fish gum, the Pompalicious, on here. Now, uh, Tony gave me some of these packages that had some misformed, mis misshapen pieces, he said. Which is fine with me because they were completely sold out of some of these flavors and uh, I just wanted to give it a try and I couldn't get my hands on them at all. It kind of reminds you of like the Bubblicious gum. I'm just gonna try it with, with just this fish gum. Here's what it looks like, very thick. So we're not gonna need anything else on there. And the wind's kind of like pulling it like this. We're gonna look for movement that's different than that to know when a fish is biting. Wow, I almost lost my hat. I may have something on this line. Let me leave that there for a second. I, I might have something. Yep, yep, we got a fish. little guy. I could see it on there though, even up oh, he got himself off. There he is. Okay buddy. Anything will keep him this bait and to prove to my clients that there are fish out here. <laughs> oh. Alright now that I'm really whack. It's crazy. Yeah we still got a fish on. <laughs> I think there's a fish. You want to grab that first one? That that little whiting just bit on the uh, fish gum only. Hey, a pompanel! Woo! Andy's first pompanel. That's a keeper too. Woo! We got we got five spikes at the top. I always grab them down here. Um, you want to grab the tail there and under the head here. Yep. Mouth all the way to the zero. And to the fork and the tail is like 12 and a half. You have to be 11 to the fork to keep, so that's like a keeper. keeper. <laughs> that pompano bit on our fishing girl silver rig. I love this silver rig. You're not going to find it anywhere else. Frisky Fins makes it exclusively for us. We're gonna toss this back out. I had it in the whitewash. That is where Pompano are gonna be. I'm gonna go use the bathroom before my clients get here. Andy is going to take over my lines. Maybe he'll catch another Pompano. Andy had a whiting and then this line was totally slack. So I told him it's probably a Pompano. He wanted to reel it in. Oh yeah, yeah, look, it's cutting. That is Pompano right there. Keep the tension on, keep it on. Oh yeah, another pompano. Keep backing up. Woo, look at that beauty. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, that's probably another keeper. Give me a picture. Yes. But it's not video. It is. Listen guys, this is fish gum that we're using, the new generation, and we're using the red fin sinker. This is how you catch pompano. Woo! Yeah, he's like 11 and a half. So a little keep bit him. smaller, but his keeper. You're going in for you? Nope. <laughs> You're having too much fun today, huh? That's a bluefish. That's see how that hit like really hard? Dude, he is feisty. That's a nice looking bluefish. It is. Hey Doug. <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna reel up the slack for you. And then I'm gonna hand it over once I'm not feeling slack. So let me make sure there's a fish on there. It's hard to tell if it's still on there or not. Let me see. Here, I'll hand it to you just in case, because they they might be uh, just not swimming really hard. <laughs> no, 
Oh no, it's still on there. Aww. It's a baby. Aww. He's got the little black tip on the on the top of his tail. Yeah. Oh, he's so cute. He's so, yeah, he is cute. I was recording, but we weren't. What's her name? Marta. She just uh, wheeled in that lighting. Oh, that one's getting hit. You can reel it up a little bit higher. <laughs> Want to hold the line? <laughs> it's not a bad size. There you go. There you go. That was easy. Oh look! You got a black drum! Nice! Alright, we gotta measure him up. See if he's big enough to keep. Here, we'll take him off the... Hang on just a second, we'll take him off the hook. <laughs> She's like, marching him right over. <laughs> you wanna hear him making noise? Here. <laughs> Yeah, he's uh, just under 13 inches oh, he's to too small. The, the whole length. Yeah, he's too small to keep. You want to hold him? Back? Yeah. Good I'll get a yeah. picture of you holding him. Oh, a smile. Awesome. Bye bye, fishy. This, uh, kind of pinkish color. If you look on the top, you can kind of see some darker stripes. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna get this back out, but this fish gum is doing awesome. Thanks so much for watching this product review video. I was using both of these flavors in that video, and you, as you can see, we caught a ton of fish. Let me know in the comments if you've tried fish gum, what your favorite flavor is, and uh, your experience with it. Now, if you have tried the, the earlier versions, you need to give these new ones a try because it's completely different. It will stay a lot longer on the hook. It doesn't dissolve right away, and um, I'm telling you what, we're catching a lot of fish with it. And you have not subscribed to our channel, you're gonna wanna subscribe because I've got beach fishing tips videos that I'm putting out every month. I've got underwater footage. We've got uh, fishing adventures. I'm doing product reviews on other people's products as well as our own products that we sell in our store at fishing-girl.com. All of that stuff's going to be in the description. Thanks so much for watching. Tight lines and God bless.